When Meghan Markle moved from the set of a little-known television show to the pink and golden world of the royal family, everyone seemed to be very happy. She went out once while not wearing tights and many people jumped up and down with glee, saying this was a radical departure for the royals. Then she turned up at a party wearing burgundy nail polish, and everyone who noticed immediately fainted with joy. Yes, they squeaked. She is someone the royal family needs, a black, American, Roman Catholic divorcee with bare legs, racy fingernails and healthy views on feminism. There was even a suggestion that if you looked carefully on the internet, you could find a picture of her wearing no top, brilliant. But then, after about seven minutes, Everyone suddenly decided she's actually a witch. First came news she complained about the smell on the church where she was married, and that she'd gone out in public with a price tag still attached to her frock, and that she was bossing Prince Harry about and having arguments with her sister-in-law. When a couple of members of her staff announced they were leaving, everyone knew for sure this was because she is a terrible woman who sits in her kitchen every night hitting puppies over the head with a shovel. And all the time. We had her ridiculous father cropping up on every TV show to say he loves her and is so sad he wasn't at the wedding and even more unhappy that she never responds to his texts. Which, translated from media speak, means, I hate her, I hate her, I hate her. And can I have a bit of money, please? At this rate, it won't be long before she is stripped and forced to walk naked through the streets of York while people with skin diseases chant shame and throw excrement at her. I can't understand why this is happening. You don't know her. I don't know her. So why have we all suddenly decided she should be mocked and pilloried for every little thing she ever does? When all is said and done, she is just a very pretty girl who's married a former army officer who will never, ever be king. As a result. She will have less impact on your life than your postman's wife. You don't hate her. So why on earth should you hate Megan?